हेलो फ्रेंड्स नो आवर टॉपिक इज कंपायर डिजाइन सो फर्स्ट टॉपिक अंडर कंपायर डिजाइन इज फर्स्ट टॉपिक और फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज दैट वट इज कंपायलर सो कंपायलर इज अ सॉफ्टवेयर विच कन्वर्ट अवर हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज प्रोग्राम टू लो लेवल लैंग्वेज सो वट इज दैट हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज एनी प्रोग्राम और एनी कोड दैट वी राइट इन अवर सी लैंग्वेज C++ प्लस प्लस और इन जावा इज अ हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज सो कंपायलर विल टेक दैट कोड दैट वी हैव राइट इन अवर सी और सी प्लस प्लस और जावा टेक दैट कोड एंड कन्वर्ट इन टू लो लेवल लैंग्वेज एंड द लो लेवल लैंग्वेज इज अ बाइनरी लैंग्वेज और इन द फॉर्म ऑफ जीरो एंड वन ओके सो वी आर जनरली वी आर कन्वर्टिंग अवर हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज टू लो लेवल लैंग्वेज सो इफ वी आर कन्वर्टिंग our program from high level language to low level language then why we don't write our programs in low level language so answer to that question is we are not comfortable in writing our programs in low level language or in binary form that's why we write all of our programs in high level language and compiler will take that code and convert that code to low level language and in binary language and that language is understandable to the computer so along with compiler there are few more software modules which work together with that so first one is preprocessor so input to preprocessor is high level language the code that we have write in our these languages is feed it to our pre processor and pre processor will take that code and convert that code to pure high level language so what is the difference between this pure high level language and high level language so when we write our code the first few lines are like this hash include and something like that or hash define so pre processor will take that code or uh, that code that we have written our c or c++ and pre processor will include these files that we have mentioned or include that we have mentioned or define the function that we have mentioned and after including this and defining this it will remove that hash tags okay after including it will remove that hash tags and give us a code which is which is in pure high level language or uh, we can say that the pure high level language is that language which which does not contain any hash lines okay so main function of that pre processor is to remove our hash lines okay so that pure high level language is fed to compiler and compiler will take that pure high level language code and convert that to assembly language okay so after assembly language the input to assembler is high um, assembly language and assembler will take that assembly language and convert the code or the assembly language code to relocatable machine code okay generally assembler generate two types of code two types of machine code one of them is absolute machine code and second type we have is relocatable machine code okay then what is the difference between this uh, absolute machine code and relocatable machine code a relocatable machine code is that code which is run from which can be run from any memory location and absolute machine code is that code which is which uh, can be run from exact memory location so generally uh, assembler will give us relocatable machine code so after that relocatable machine code is given to our linker and loader and linker and loader will get that relocatable machine code as a input and give us executable code and that code is 
एक्स इक्वल टू कोड ओके सो इन फाइनल स्टेज दो सो इन फाइनल स्टेज वी गेट एक्स इक्वल टेबल कोड सो ऑल दिस आर द सॉफ्टवेयर मॉड्यूल्स व्हिच वर्क अलोंग विथ कंपाइलर नो वी आर कंसर्न विथ ओनली दिस कंपाइलर सो वी विल गो इन टू द डिटेल ऑफ दिस कंपाइलर ओके okay.